Hello friends, in last video we have seen how to create a controller. In that we have seen we created our method and we written the hello world. So in this video we have to learn how to create a model class. That is a Pojo class. So this is a controller and now we have to create a model class. So for creating model class, just right click here. Click on new, click on a class. So also should declare the separate package for a model also. So I am declaring model com dot and name as a model class as a I give name as a items. And let's finish. So this is our model class. So first, first of all, suppose if you want to details of items which are available in any, just like a, we searching on e-commerce site, any e-commerce, uh, we will uh, search like when we order on Amazon, Flipkart. So then that time, suppose we want some items details. So first I am declaring variable. Just, just item name ID. We should declare all the variables private. So the, because this is a Pojo class, plain old Java object. I also call this is a model class. Because we will fetch the data from a database, and this is a item name. So we declare variable in a private and also we want a constructor for assigning value. So for that just you have to right click here. Go to on a source. Here you can see the source. And create constructor using this field. And generate. So this is our constructor. So here you can see the public items and which pass the parameter so also we want to get a sign setters method if you want to know about a getter and setters method so you can check these channels in that you will get so here for getter and setters just you have to right click same goes to source here you can see the generate getter assign status. So select all and generate. So here you can see the public int get id also set id. We can set id and we can access from a database. I also want to Two string method for printing the object on a view. View add, view means it is a HTML page and any web page. So also right click here, go to on a source, generate two string. Click on a generate. So here you can see the two string method. So that's done our work so this is our model class just time created one class and create variable all all variables should have private and i have assigned the parameterized constructor 
I have taken a getter and status methods and two string method. After that video, in next video we will see how to access these records, just like items, ID, name, price. Same like when we go on any e-commerce site and we search that item, so we will get the detail. Just I have taken here name, price, any and ID only. So that's all about the model class that is a pojo class so thank you for watching this video